So a quick update for console players of Power World, the latest patch has just dropped. Uh, if you missed this, it actually released late last night on PC. But today guys, for Xbox players mainly, I'll give you another rundown on the patch notes and hopefully the fixes many of you may be having. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so this patch dropped last night, well the patch notes dropped last night, but the Steam patch dropped with the patch notes, Xbox had to wait. Uh, so yes, yeah, so many of you may have missed this, so let's just go through it quickly again. Okay, so both patches are now out, but if you missed them, these are the patch notes. Major fixes. Fixed an issue where the game would always crash and save data would be corrupted when the total number of powers captured by the guild reached approximately 7,000. Okay, so in the previous patch, save data that had already been in this state for servers, the server's world data remained in a broken state that made it impossible to load. But after applying this patch, it will be resolved and will load properly. Fix an issue where some weapons equipped by other players would disappear when a player used a grenade in multiplayer. Fix an issue where although the displayed capture probability increased when the capture power was strengthened with lift monk effigies, the capture probability did not actually increase at all due to an internal processing bug. I'm so glad that one of these fix people, I suffered with that. Base related. Fix an issue where if a power was manually assigned to a breeding farm uh, that went to sleep, it would not wake up forever. I mean, I don't know why that makes me laugh inside, but it just does. Okay, so yeah, that's fixed now. Fix an issue where no wood would drop when a pallet base fell a tree. Okay, so on to others. Implemented countermeasures against some cheats and exploits. Good to see. Hopefully they keep working on this. And then they say we will continue development, placing top priority on fixing major problems and issues. Thank you for your continued support for Powerwood. So there we have it guys, that patch has now been dropped on Xbox, it was already released on PC but if you're a console player, expect an update, I think on PC I'm not sure it was like a couple of gig if that, uh, probably won't be that much on Xbox though, but yes, the patch is now live guys, hopefully it resolve any issues you may be having, especially with those save files, because I'm seeing I've actually got friends that have suffered with this too. So there we have it guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, it really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.